Hi friends, it's Miss G again. Thanks for joining me today. Today we're going to read the book 10 Black Dots by Donald Cruz. So we're going to read about counting to 10 again. All right. So this is the number 10. 10. What can you do with 10 black dots? Hmm. Let's find out. One dot can make a sun or moon when day is done. So one dot is the sun, one dot is the moon. Two dots can make the eyes of a fox. One, two. Or the eyes of keys that open locks. One, two. Three dots can make a snowman's face. One, two, three, we have two eyes and a nose. Or beads for stringing on a lace. One, two, three. Do you like to string beads on lace? Yeah, sometimes that's good for our hands. Four dots can make seeds from which flowers grow. One, two, three, four. Four different seeds. Or the knobs on a radio. One, two, three, four. I like to listen to the radio and dance, don't you? So much fun. Five dots can make buttons on a coat. One, two, three, four, five. Can you button your coat? Yeah, we have to practice. It takes a lot of hard work and practice. Or the portholes on a boat. One, two, three, four, five. Six dots can make marbles that you hold. Half are new, the rest are old. So we have one, two, three in this hand and one, two, three in this hand. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Three plus three equals six. Let's find out what happens when we add one more to make seven. Seven dots can make the spots on a snake. Ooh, I don't like snakes, do you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or stones turned up by a garden rake. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do you ever help rake the yard? Yeah, that's good. It's hard work, but it's good to get up all the leaves and the debris that's in the yard sometimes. Makes it easier to mow. And it's always good to help mommy and daddy or your grandparents, or your aunt and uncle. <clears throat> Eight dots can make the wheels of a train, carrying freight through sun and rain. See the choo-choo train? All right, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight dots make the wheels. Nine dots can make toy soldiers standing in rank. Mm, look at these soldiers. Do you like to play soldiers? Yes. All right, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine soldiers. Or the pennies in your piggy bank. Ooh, I like money. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine pennies in the piggy bank but I'd rather than be quarters, because quarters are worth 25 cents, whereas pennies are only one. 10 dots can make balloons stuck in a tree. Uh-oh, I like to hold a balloon, not get, let it get stuck in a tree, but let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten 10 balloons stuck in a tree. Shake the branch and set them free. Hmm, that sounds good. Great plan. Let's count one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, let's keep reading. Count them. Are there really ten? Now we can begin again. Counting dots from one to ten. One, one, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. Four. 
one, two, three, four, five. And what do we notice about our pattern? Every time we add one more, one more, one more, one more to get to our next number. What number is gonna come after five? That's right, six. So we have six. <clears throat> one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Notice I put my finger on every one that I was counting so I didn't lose track. It's very important. That's what good mathematicians do. The end. Now, can you draw a picture with black dots? Can you draw me a picture with 10 black dots? What can you create? I can't wait to see them. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you subscribe so you can hear more books about um, counting and shapes and the alphabet so we can learn together. Toodaloo!